What's going on guys? Cyborg G here, back again with another MK Mobile video. Man, oh man, oh man. They never cease to disappoint. Oh. As we have a look here. Classic Smoke Special Bundle. Um, It's been out for about two or three days, that's why it says three hours left. I'm always just making a video on this. But basically, they've released this new character that we've all been hyped, well, semi hyped for since we've found out that he's just a reskin and he uses the same fight animations from different characters. But nevertheless, he's been shoved in a pack that you can't save up souls for. They want you to spend real money for. Like, what do you mean? Um, the chances are to get him is 20%. One gold character card, 80%, and then 100% chance to get four gold character cards. So, in total, you get five cards, but only one of them, you have a 20% chance of getting smoked. So, you're getting ripped off, basically. And you might think, oh, it's £10, it's not that much. For a gold card, I don't think, well, I wouldn't pay any money, especially not to these guys, for what they give us. I'd pay you for a pack if it was guaranteed, but unfortunately, it's not. And, it, oh, it's just so annoying. It's really pissed me off. Um, I just can't believe it. Like, I know I have been saying I've lowered expectations, and I'm not surprised at what they do, but I really am. They just don't, they always find a new way to surprise me, and not in a good way either. So... All them people that have been hyped, or semi-hyped to get this character, you, you can't get him at all, unless you pay for him. And if you remember the tweet, if you haven't seen it, it says something on amongst the lines of, um, you know, it's a flash sale, like, you know, you get him now before you never see him again, essentially. Um, they used all the fancy wording in to make it sound like, he was coming in a quest mode or something because, you know, they used a similar wording for Classic Reptile, which is what everyone speculated. But, no, they meant get it now before it disappears because they're putting it in a fucking pack. So, we don't know what's happening with him in terms of after this pack, are we going to get him in a challenge? Are we going to get him in faction wars? Are we going to get him in quests? We don't know, they've not said anything, like, they've not hinted at anything, it's literally just this pack that we've got, unfortunately. See, look, available now, oh, if I would have, you know, said the little text, but, nevertheless, it doesn't. Yeah, this is it, secret character from the past emerges, mm -hmm. open a special bundle for a chance to collect classic smoke and his signature equipment car before he's gone. In all the tweets and Instagram posts, they've been hinting at getting now before he's gone. Now, I don't know if that's just a marketing strat to make people think, oh, well, we're not going to get him for seven months, so we better buy him now before we have to wait seven months to get him. Or if they actually mean this, and, you know, like I've just said, like seven months down the line, we might get him back. But there again, I really... Well, again, it's never realm, so they could do, but I couldn't see them making us wait for a few months just to release the pack again. But considering it's in a real life monetary um, pack and not just a normal car pack, I don't know how it's going to work because, as you know, like all these car packs, the sole ones, they're on a rotary basis, so, like, you know. In a couple of weeks' time, we'll get the Outworld Diamond Pack again, but it will cycle through all the other Diamond Variation Packs and Gold Packs. But because you have to pay real-life money for it, will we get it back again? I have... To, well, I'd say I hope so, to, for the sake of you guys, to get it back. Um, but I, I really hope that they change it up and put him into a mode or a tower first. Um, I think they might do that because if you remember MK11 Cabal, when they first released him, I'm pretty sure he came in a real-life money um, pack bundle, not a Souls pack. 
His challenge came out later on, but when he was first initially, initially released, you had to get him in a pack. Um, I can't remember for sure if it was if you had to pay real life money or if it was sold for the Cabal pack, but nevertheless, they did that first. And then, you know, they didn't say anything for a couple of weeks about a challenge for him coming out or anything like that. And then he just came out of nowhere. So that makes me think again that this is just a marketing strat to make everyone panic by it, thinking they're not going to see him again, just for him to come out in a couple of weeks' time. So, and even if that's not the case, don't buy the pack anyway. It's just not worth it. It really isn't. Like, £10 for a 20% chance to get a specific gold card gold card just bear that in mind like no it's just not worth it guys um nothing else new really um got the shitty towers getting repetitive already um so far let me just show you my equipment cards Scorpion. so i've got for survivor memories twice Secret scrolls once and then there we go. Champions leather braces, so that's one to four cards in total, and that's from doing 34 battles on a normal tower. I can't remember which specific card I got from what tower, but 34 battles in a normal one and 97 in the fatal tower. Um I'm pretty sure I've got more cards. I'm pretty sure I got three cards out of the normal tower and then one out of the fatal. So it looks like if you want, you can, well, again, I don't know how the, you know, the drop rates work, if it's different to each tower, but you never know. But other than that, nothing new added to the Faction War store, n nothing added anywhere. Um, if they do bring out a release date for a challenge for classic smoke or anything of the sort i will let you guys know make a video on it straight away um on behalf of never realm i'd like to apologize to you all for the disappointment they've brought they're absolute wankers and i can't believe they've actually done this but that's just crossed the line for me having all hope for this game developing and listening to the fans but oh well what can you do um but anyways Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.